Welcome back. This is going to be our final mega segment for Diversion Retrospective 4.0. Uh, this is the first time I took a trip overseas. Usually I, I got video footage sent to me, but uh, I went to Australia to check out the Brisbane scene and also to go visit Simon O'Brien at his house down in Arrow Bay. Uh, it was an awesome time, awesome adventure, so check it out. You know, we just try and do our own thing. We don't worry about other people and just, you know, do whatever we like to do and have fun. Uh, the flatland scene in Australia is it's pretty tight-knit. The Brisbane scene is probably the most strongest. Uh, down in Sydney, there's, there's a, a whole bunch of new school riders, a lot of old school riders as well. Western Australia, there's a good scene. Adelaide, there's uh, a few good riders out there as well. There's all flatlanders in small little areas that just ride by themselves and just, you know, just do their own thing and it's good. <laughs> Stuart Munro's got, uh, he holds jams. Uh, usually two, two times a year and they're called Back to Basics. The idea behind Back to Basics is just to get everyone together, just ride, have a good time. He's just doing the right thing for, for Flatland so I've got a lot of respect for Stuart. 2020 BMX Magazine is an Australian magazine. It's a partnership between Mike Daly and Matt Holmes. It's not a big magazine, it just it does its own thing and it's not run by corporate companies. It's, it's just writers that write articles, put it together and, and try and make the Australian scene as positive as possible. I just write articles, uh, review products, uh, interview writers, do basic bios, um, cover jams, flatland sessions, um, whatever, and if people want to add some stuff in as well, then, then they're more than welcome to. If you're out for a good holiday, then, then Australia is the place to be. It's beautiful weather to ride in, uh, there's, there's some good concrete parks, there's you know, some good flatland spots around as well, so it's worth coming out here for a trip. A lot of people I think that coming from such a small area, a small town, to see somebody go so well maybe, it's kind of unbelievable or amazing. I think it's, you know, sometimes helps to live in like such a small area. You've got a lot of time to spend, you know, pursuing your, your dream and hobby and whatever. The thing I like about flat is it's such a personal thing. I like the technical side of flatland and you can really try and develop and change your style if you want. The riding scene here where I live is pretty much nil. Younger grommets and stuff, but no real flatlanders at all.
lot of people think it's pretty cool. Like uh, locally, I get, you know, I think people realise that, you know, what I do and I'm stoked for me. 92.7 Bay Basin FM, that was the Whitlam's there, and we're joined in the studio now by Simon O'Brien. You've just returned recently from the X Games in LA. You actually took that out? Uh, I guess. I got lucky and just had a good day. I would prefer just to stay around home and surf and ride and try and progress but I think it's such a great opportunity when you can uh, travel and meet so many people and see the world and make money while you do it if you're lucky. America, Japan, Canada, Malaysia, China, all of Europe, it's crazy such a good thing to be able to witness and see what a lot of different cultures are like. We get the opportunity to live by a beach town, beach area, definitely take advantage, got to do it, it's awesome. Such good wildlife, just, you know, not a lot of people, awesome surf spots, you know, it's low key. I don't want to move from Australia. I love it. Making a video, Blender, Blender. Four point is in, has taken birth. Four point oh, diversion, in the process right now, Nicole. Gotta go. I'm Bobby's AD. I'm the assistant director, Nicole. Flatland's not supposed to be in the dirt. Or uphill. Or on an incline. It's ridiculous. It really is. It's not supposed to happen like this. <laughs> it's really not. <laughs> I don't think it is. Especially with that trick. You don't understand these roads. They're steep. It's hard pedaling up them regularly. 